Fortnite just added the Crash Pad Jr. back into the game. And here are four tips you can use to win more games with this item. And I promise you, this last one, no one else knows about. So first off, you can Flowberry Rotate with the Crash Pad. So first, you throw the Crash Pad onto the ground towards the direction that you want to rotate. Then you pop your Flowberry or your Flowberry Fizz. Then you run and slide into the Crash Pad for the most momentum and the farthest leap possible. As you can see, this is almost literally like using a launch pad in terms of how far you're going. And you go significantly further than then just running into a regular crash without the low gravity effect. Now the second tip, if you were to hit back to back crash pads like in this clip, your momentum carries you even further than the first method I showed you. Note that you need the low gravity effect to get this insane rotation down. Now before we go into my next clip, I want to shout out Dis for commenting on my last video. I so appreciate the kind words. If you guys want to be shouted out in my next video, comment down below. Now for the fourth tip, let's say you're playing a larger team mode. You can Flowberry Fizz your whole team and then everyone sprints into the same crash pad. This is a far better rotation compared to say to a shockwave rotate, since it's a bit of more controlled rotation. As you can see in this clip, I call for my teammate to throw their crash pad down on this side of the bunker. I then Flowberry Fizz and then we all hit the same rotation instead of just running out in the open all the way down this hill. This was in some high level zero build squad money scrims. I think you can apply this method to say either build duos or trios or just your pub games, whatever it may be. I think this is a really, really strong rotate. And my last point, the spawn rates of chess items have actually been adjusted with the addition of this new Crash Pad Junior item. According to my friends over at Osiren GG, the Crash Pads have 11.7% chance of spawning, while the other big movement item in the game, the Grapple Blade, now only has a 7.84% chance of spawning. People always say adapt or get left behind, and I hope these tips and tricks help you win your future games. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and good luck out there.